Hello and welcome once again to the Rugged Rock Hound. Today I'm actually just out hiking. I'm here with my brother. We're hiking up Hartley Canyon here in southern Idaho. And I figured as long as I'm here, let's bring the GoPro. Let's look at the rocks and if there's anything cool, make sure to film finding something cool while hiking up the canyon. So not really a rock hounding trip, but a hiking trip where maybe there's something worth, worth finding up in there. Cool cliff right there. Anyway, in case I do find something, here's the GPS coordinates to where we're parked here at the mouth of Hartley Canyon. You can drive up it, like it's a road for driving, but we kind of want to hike it and I want to look at the rocks on the way. So yeah, let's see what we can find. So we just started. Already found some red jasper and some brown jasper. That brown jasper looks like it's coming out of the limestone. I mean, it might be part of just the road base that was brought in, but I don't know, that brown one looks like it might have come out of the limestone up here. Nice. And look at that. That is a mix of red and brown. And this is not part of the road base. This is definitely some of the rocks from the canyon. So there's some nice jasper at this canyon. Oh man, how big is that? <laughs> big enough. that okay we've got some ants growing here but wow really cool so here I am right at the base of this cliff right at the mouth of the canyon and you can see the little bits of brown jasper some of it a little red in some of the rock here a little bit right there definitely was better looking quality down there Probably because it weathered out. But it's all through here. Look at that big chunk of brown jasper. Cool. So I'm starting to see some interesting stuff up here. Look at that. We've got some crystal growth on this one. A little bit of quartz druzy in the uh, jasper here. That's nice. What I really like that I saw was this. Look at that. It's a chalcedony, almost agate. Wow. This is getting exciting now. And this is just a hike. We, I wasn't expecting to find anything really up while hiking here. There's no, no known rock hounding around here really that I've heard about. That is really cool. Here's this one cut open. Okay, not too bad. It's kind of nice, got some cool patterns in it. Oh, I see another pocket of druzy. Oh, this big thing right here. Let's get this down here where we can see a little better. Nice. Oh, look at it sparkle in the sun. Anything on the backside? Not much. Cool though. Here, this got a cool vein in it. Look at those veins through that. Really nice. And I'm starting to see other colors now. Still not great colors. So far, that red has been the best. But definitely some variety. And I mean, most of it's lower grade, and there's a lower grade all over the place. But there is some higher grade. Whoa! Look at that, Druzy. That's pretty. Look at all that red. <laughs> That's really nice. Now this one's really pretty too. Look at that, look at the druzy on that. Some really cool shapes in there. Got some slightly bigger quartz crystals on some of these. That one's really pretty. Very nice. What do we have here? Something really cool. Let's take that. <laughs> look at the druzy on that one. It's much more, has more white in it. And there's something next to it I thought might be worth taking a gander at. Okay, some more of the brown. A little bit of druzy on it. Just so you can see how abundant this stuff is. There's a big brown one right there. There's one with some red in it. Let's that out a bit. Yeah. And 
then you got some right here again. There's more of a kind of a grayish color one. Another brown one there. Stuff really is all over. It's a matter of finding the uh, nice quality ones. Here's that really red one cut open. It broke open a, a bit, but this is what it looks like. Okay, it's got a few little lines in it. It's not that great though. It, it It's kind of porous in places. Not as good as hoping, but still kind of neat. So my brother found this one. He wanted me to take a look at that. Look at that circle in the middle of it. I wonder if that has something to do with the formation. That is really cool though. Look at that. Beautiful. Here's a larger piece. Doesn't look quite as nice as that one, but it's similar to that one. It was close to it. And I believe I see another piece of it kind of right here. Oh, cool. Interesting. So we're back down at the pathway. My brother found this one down here. Look at that. Look at the druzy in that thing. That is beautiful. Look at that. That's a nice one. So I'm just going to go ahead and pile all the rocks we found here. And because the vehicle's just down there. And then we're going to continue the hike. And if we find anything further up the road, we'll bring you back in. So my brother said he saw something really amazing over here and he kind of hit it a little bit. So we're going to... Oh, what is that? It's a gear. <laughs> uh. Dig it out. Didn't you want artificial stuff too? <laughs> Man-made stuff? Not quite what I usually look for when I'm rock counting. Well, how many gears do you find rock counting? Cool. I now have a gear. Woohoo! Here's a snake in the road. It's a really small one. I don't know snake species very well. It's not a rattlesnake. But... So we've hiked up the canyon a ways now. And look at the size of that tallow slope. Rocks here look a little different, so I'm not sure what we're going to find in that, but I'm going to wander up there and see if there's anything good in there. So here you can see all of this limestone. So it's the same limestone that we saw down at the entrance of the, cab the canyon, but it's not nearly as altered. So you're not seeing the jasper. At least I haven't seen any yet. I mean, I'll wander out a little bit more, but looks like it's pretty much all this limestone. Sometimes you'll find fossils, but so far this limestone seems to be pretty much devoid of any large fossils. So we hiked up the canyon quite a ways. The further you got, the lesser the quality of the uh, jasper until it disappeared entirely. Kept walking for a while, didn't see anything, didn't really see any fossils. So came back. So this is right at the mouth of the canyon. And so we were right over there in that area. I wanted to try and maybe check this area, but maybe wrap around here where it's easier to go up and maybe try up higher because most of the better stuff seemed to be further up on the talus slope. So I kind of wanted to go up and see what we got up there. Okay, I got this piece. So when you get stuff that has more of a, an outside that looks like that, I think you're getting into the higher quality stuff. I see one over here. Yeah. Oh, there we go. There's that better stuff again. So yeah, I did have to get higher up to get into this stuff. Here's this one cut open. Yeah, I was excited about this one. Ooh, and it doesn't disappoint. Look at that. Okay, this is worth going out there for. Stuff like this. If I can get more like this, it's kind of a, a mossy agate. Oh, that's really nice. That's a pretty little one. Yeah, I like that. And what we got down here? Some more jasper. This one looks pretty nice. Definitely one of the more red ones I've seen. Okay. I like those little pockets through there. Cool. Now that one looks really cool closer look at this. <laughs> oh cool. So you got the 
tan jasper all around it. And then you got this zone where you got some crystals. Cool. So I saw this nice quartz on the top of it and it might be worth cutting into. So I'm gonna take that back and try cutting into it and just see if it's worth it. That's pretty cool. Definitely the uh, largest druzy I've seen up here. Cool quartz crystals all over it. Not great under there, but that's cool. Here's this one cut open. Oh, oh, look at that. Okay. I, I was right thinking that things like that could be pretty nice inside. Oh, that is cool. I love those fractures in there and how they filled in. And we're back at the vehicle. Not bad for a day where we're just planning on hiking and doing, uh, just spending some time together. I wasn't expecting uh, that good of Jasper in this area. When I say good, it's decent. Not enough that I'd want to come back out here, but it's still worth it, like, because you can just drive up here. This is the mouth of the canyon, and it's just this outcrop right here. It's right there at the beginning. So, not too bad. Decent day. I hope you enjoyed it, and until next time, remember, there is treasure everywhere.